జర్నీ ఫ్రమ్ బిగినింగ్ టు నౌ Um, I'm really happy for that guys. Thank you so much for subscribing and I also request all others who are just viewing my video uh, but are not subscribing request you to please subscribe guys that's really important for me. Uh, it's really free so please subscribe and do support me by subscribing the channel. Uh, yeah. Uh, in today's video what I'm going to do is I'm going to visit the temple which is nearby my location um I'll just give you overview of how our uh, temples look here uh, I'm visiting the nearest Hindu temple here uh, and just want to visit today to a temple um so l- let me let me take you guys along with me and after that I uh, remember that there is a flea market nearby to the temple place uh, so let's see if I could go there uh, on time because I heard that it's open on Tuesdays and Wednesdays uh, but I'm not sure if it is open to a, till 12 o'clock I am uh, going there now at 11 o'clock I guess so let's see if the flea market is open I will be able to show you guys um how the flea market looks like and at what price you guys can get here um so yeah without any further ado let's start the video morning and how i had a head bath uh, so my hair is looking really dry, really frizzy and dry sorry for that guys but i'm just heading towards the temple and uh, let's have the darshan first go to flea market and then come back and i have a event today in uh, my university it's not my university actually my university people are conducting a shopping event uh, wherein we are supposed to uh, book for the event and go to the cleveland center uh, where our event is going on so students are going to get huge discount on all shopping uh, items uh, it can be clothing it can be shoes it can be uh, anything whey protein it can be anything so uh, so after coming from the flea market i'm going to shoot that as well so do not skip the video guys let me show you guys uh, how a student shopping event happens here in uk uh, so universities are really great uh, in welcoming students from international and the uk students itself uh, they wanted to create an interactive environment for the students uh, so that they can uh, they feel free and they don't feel that uh, they are not welcome Uh, or something like that uh, they conduct a lot of events they conduct a lot of uh, uh, parties uh, parties uh group discussions uh, they conduct online events for the people who cannot attend the uh, university fairs uh, they conduct a lot they even give free food sometimes so uh, keep an eye keep visiting your universities guys when you are in a different country you have to network with lot of people uh, so that you get uh, get to know a lot of people with through which you might get part time jobs through which you might uh, through which you might hear a uh, lot of opportunities you might know a lot of things so explore as much as you can uh, do not hurt anyone here uh, so whenever there is an event going on uh, participate in that event and get to know a lot of people so me and my friends are visiting a temple nearby So this is the sweet little UK style temple uh, which I visited for the first time. Mm-hmm. 
looks like many idols have been placed here there is a uh, venkateshwar swami uh, ganesh durga mata shri krishna this is pretty much how the interior of the temple looks like guys uh people can come here and provide their prasad uh and sometimes even langar happens maybe now this is me feeling shy to talk in front of the pandit there done with mandir now we are visiting the flea market uh we are going to the flea market to check the vegetable prices guys uh, we usually buy vegetables in the nearby supermarket however we were told that there is a market uh near to uh the temple road uh to check uh what kind of vegetables are available what kind of fruits are available at what prices they are available we are heading towards the flea market there Now these look like second hand products guys it has clothing it has accessories it has a uh, home living uh, area uh, items and many more i guess uh, i guess you can bargain with the people here uh, i'm not sure about that but I, i i'm just seeing it for the first time here i guess people can even come here and sell their goods uh, at a good price maybe now these are china items uh, there are a lot of plates cutleries and everything came at the closing time and i can't see lot of vegetables and fruits here guys uh, but whatever i had here i found that it was a little pricey it was not that cheap here uh, but just having a look on all the items these guys are providing here so here i have come for taking some vegetables fruits are really affordable guys those were blueberries these are apples tomatoes uh, anyone can survive uh, while eating fruits here fruits are really affordable we're going to find the okay there's some there for 4 pound or 3 packs for a tenner okay all all seven together it's 4 4 pounds yeah all seven together life how, how much i don't i don't want the whole basket right 1 2 3 4 five basket okay 1.50 that's what shall you see yes really? yeah buy your like yeah buy your, like, yeah. so much yeah, five basket I, i know no, but still actually still yeah. mm. wow. five one basket pound. that's one whole pound. whole f- i saw this morning one basket one pound ipra okay. anni four basket five pound. basket left i charge you 1.50 one pound thank you your saturday open they were trying to take that day thank you now going back to home and as i said i'm going to get ready and attend the university student uh, shopping event
arrived here at 6 o'clock uh, in the evening. Usually, the shops here are closed at 5 p.m. However, as we had student night, uh, all the shops were almost open. Sorry. I mean, the one which was sponsoring the student event. This is me, pretty much confused as I'm not sure where to shop, what to shop. It's all freaking me out. if we spin the wheel and get a discount that's applicable when you shop. Yeah. 